Okay, so hey YouTube. Um, this is a video on how you're gonna jailbreak uh, any iDevice except for iPad on four four point two point one and below. So you're gonna want to download Red Snow. That's version. That's uh yeah. So you want to download Red Snow, get the latest version. You're gonna open it up. This is Red Snow uh, zero point nine point six B two. Now what's going to happen is that you're going to get an error if, if uh, when you start jailbreaking and they're going to have to go through the whole process of redoing it all over. So to prevent that, you're going to right click on the bottom taskbar over here. You're going to go to start task manager and you're going to find red snow. Uh, what happens to be right here. You're going to right click on that and you're going to hit set infinity. Empty. You're going to uncheck all processors, then you're going to just check CPU 1 and hit OK. Now you can exit. Now what we're going to do is browse for your firmware. For me, it's 4.1 on for iPhone 3G. Open that up, browse, click, open. Processing firmware, ISPW successfully identified. Click Next. Alright, now it comes to this screen. You want to make sure install city is checked. That's probably going to be checked. And then, if you want verbose boot, you can have that. Custom boot logo, you can have that. And custom re recovery logo, you can have that. I don't want those things. And I'm probably not going to. And I don't want home screen wallpaper or battery percentage. I only want multitasking. If you do a home screen wallpaper and multitasking, it slows down the performance a lot. Battery percentage, I really don't know. So then once you do that, check whatever ones you want. Click next. And now it's going to say plug it in and then turn it off. Make sure it's completely off. You should hear a dun dun when it's off. Okay, so this is probably going to be really laggy, but you're going to plug it in until you hear a And now once it goes dun dun once or twice, however many times it takes, you're gonna you're gonna power off, so hold the top button, slide the power off, slide it, power it off. Alright, so now it's completely powered off and you heard the doo doo. And now over here it's going to say make sure it is completely powered off and what you're going to do is you're going to get ready to hold down the home or the power of the home and get ready so you're going to click next and you're going to hold down the power button for two seconds and then hold down the home and power for ten seconds Then you're gonna release the power button. Just hold down the home button for 30 sec or 15 seconds until you hear a. And keep holding it down until you see a black screen on your iPhone, like that, and then you can let go. Uploading RAM. This see, this is where I would get stuck. If you didn't do that one process before, where you have to choose your CPUs, this is where I would get stuck. Rebooting. The rest of this process is done, it takes place on your iPhone. So you're just going to click finish. And now, and now on your iPhone, it's just going to go through all this stuff. This, you're going to see a bunch of little pictures. Now it's rebooting. 
So yeah, that's basically it. From there, you're pretty much done. It'll just reboot, and you'll be good to go. Just install Cydia, or uh, just watch Cydia, and you're good. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.